Chains are a popular tool in the strength training world, yet I see tons of people, especially on social media, use this completely idiotic chain setup. As you can, in fact, some companies even sell them with this, the collar attached to the chain so you can hang it straight from the top. Now, in this setup, which is completely useless, you will have roughly a difference in loading between the bottom and the top of around six to seven pounds per chain, depending on your height. Now, the goal of using chains when you're squatting, bench pressing, or deadlifting is to create a large difference in loading between the bottom position and the top position. The greater the difference, the greater the training effect of the chain. If I'm putting the chains like this at the top, I'm going to have probably one or two links on the floor. In fact, if I'm taller than 5'11", which is not my case, you're going to have no links touching the floor. In the bottom, I'm going to have probably six or seven more links on the floor, making for a total difference of roughly seven pounds. This chain weighs 26 pounds and there are 20 links. Now, the proper setup for chains is using either a strap or a smaller chain to hang the chains from, and then you are folding the chain in two. That allows you to have the same number of links touching the floor when you are at the top as with this setup, but in the bottom, all the links will be on the floor making for a difference of around 22-24 pounds per side. If you count both sides, that is roughly 45 pounds versus 14 pounds with this setup. Enormous difference in loading, especially if you are using more than one set of chain per side. That is the proper way of using chains on a squat or a bench or a deadlift. Using that setup is worthless. It will only make you look hardcore in the gym, but people who really know will look at you with a smile because you're completely foolish.